Hi, my name's Willis, and one half of performance tennis training. So, do you think one of these can really make a difference to your tennis serve? Well, we're gonna find out. What's up YouTube? So my name's Will and I am one half of performance tennis training. So today we're going to be working on, on a elbow positioning drill to get a bit more power on your serve. So you've probably seen from the thumbnails that why is one of these, a pen or a pencil or anything of the sort, super useful when it comes to playing tennis and most importantly serving? Why, why is that important? Well, more importantly, how do you get power? Well, you've got to get power by first compressing the muscles and releasing that stored energy. You see a lot of recreational players, especially kind of early juniors where they get taught the scratch back, they get stuck here. So they're either here or they're stuck, and there's not much going on regarding getting from here to here. You also see a lot of people serving with a really open angled racket. So from what I've seen from my experience, and using a couple of like coaching softwares, when you look at Novak Djokovic or Roger or any of the big four, I say Murray because he's still in my eyes, the big four and they got hurt, their angle of their arm is super compressed. So you'll probably see the screen now, I'll probably put, let's say, Novak. Novak on the side. And if you look at his angle, he's around, remember correctly, 24-ish degrees, 20 degrees, where he's compressing his arm here. Like most players, Roger, same thing. They're really compressing that arm. So I want to see you guys do it, oh, how you guys do I want to show you guys out there how to get more power on your serve. So again, from the thumbnail, look up this pen. So I'm going to put a pen right here. So it's a pen, sort of ballpoint pen right there. What we're going to do is we're going to put this ballpoint pen inside the crease of my elbow, my forearm. You can see it here, put it in close. You can see how I'm trying to get that nice 20 odd degree angle with my elbow. So when I go back to looking normally, if I was to do a regular a serving motion, if I get to my position, I'm juggling these things in my hand here, but I'm getting that nice solid, I always try and say a triangle shape. So I get that lovely triangle shape here, compressing the arm, get a nice little angle about 20 odd degrees. So, if you close 20 odd degrees, that's awesome. But, what we're gonna do, put the ball of your pen inside your forearm. Try and keep the rack here a bit more forward, so you have a nice high elbow, classic high elbow on the serve's good. If you're down here, it's not so effective at getting that transition of power for the swing. So, what we're going to do, if you can hear from back here, is we're going to compress the arm, nice and abbreviated, nothing too crazy. Hold, set, hit. Great time, by the way. So, for the people below, before I do another serve, can anyone tell me in the comments below, and don't Google this, because that's cheating, what year of racket was this, was it released? What year was it released, more than like? Was it released in the 90s, released in the 80s, released in the 2020s? So you so, so you think, and comment below and let me know what you think. If you guess it right, do me a favor, you gotta smash that like button, because that's why we do it. So, let's go again, I'll stand a bit closer. So I'm compressing that pen, I'm really compressing the pen. High elbow, that lovely, lovely solid uh, choby pose. Hold, and snap. You can just see the pen fly forward. The pen's dropping down, you're not getting any extension through impact. You want that pen to project forward. So I'll do it again. I've got two balls here, two pens. So, ball point, in hand, in, in the arm. Lock it in, it's nice and firm. Hold it up, high elbow, hold, snap. Pen going out. So, for a little nugget of advice, try pronating as well. Get a lovely extension of your wrist. Let's go again. So compress the arm. I've got one more ball, some in my pocket here. And said hold, compress. I'll go for a full serve here. Oh god. This looks heavy. Yes, that. And through. That was out. But you get the idea. I'm trying to compress the arm and fire the pen as far as the can away. So you can probably see here, got this camera. Is that the farest pens away, rough about here is the kind of rough spot where they mostly are. And the farthest one is over there. And that is obviously the one that went the furthest. It's the last one I want more energy into the swing. But again, it's super duper important that you keep this in mind, that compressing the arm is super important. And I want you guys to get more power in the serve without having to work so hard and kind of wear different parts of your body away that you don't need to wear away. So that was my little nugget of advice for the day. My name's Will. I am one part of former tennis training. And this has been a little bit of advice on how to get more power on your serve. So if you like this kind of content, mentioned before, go on and dig that like button so you get more power, more content and more, well, more, more 
content, to make content around. More drives the channel, and I'll see you guys in the near future. Thanks a lot. Bye.